DNA is the basic carrier of genetic information. It gives us an individual's blueprint so that we can more effectively battle some of humanity's deadliest diseases. Called precision medicine, this clinical approach is one of the most exciting advances in modern medicine. Learn what precision medicine promises for clinicians and patients on this episode of Healthy Dialogues. As we all remember from Biology 101, DNA is a molecule that contains all the genetic plans for an organism. While it was discovered back in 1869, scientists didn't yet know it had anything to do with our genetic traits. It wasn't until decades later that scientists looked to DNA as the place for genetic information. That began a whole new field of science, searching for how it all worked. When doctors Watson, Crick and Franklin discovered the double helix structure of the DNA molecule in 1953, it paved the way to crack the genetic code and actually sequence genes. This discovery and subsequent genetic work has led to incredible advancements and new fields of science, including precision medicine. Precision medicine is an emerging approach to disease prevention and treatment that takes into account people's individual variation in genes, environment, and lifestyle. The basic principle is that if we understand a disease at the genetic level, we can give specific medicine that will treat that illness better and with fewer side effects for that patient. Healthcare organizations around the world are actively applying the principles of precision medicine to patient care, and Intermountain Healthcare is no exception. Cancer genomics is one of our most prominent examples where we've seen success in treatment of stage four cancer patients. After a patient is evaluated by our oncology team, the process to treat their cancer looks something like this. First, our lab obtains a biopsy of their cancer. Then we pull DNA from their cancerous tissue and sequence it, comparing their tumor's DNA to established genetic abnormalities found in other cancers. And finally, we pinpoint that patient's cancerous mutations and recommend medicines that are known to treat these specific mutations. Because these medicines are so targeted, our patients have far fewer side effects than other standard treatments like chemotherapy. Over time, everyone in the field hopes this targeted approach will improve patient outcomes and reduce costs compared to standard therapies. Cancer is just one of the ways that precision medicine can be effective. It also has the potential to treat genetic disorders and chronic conditions like behavioral health disorders and heart conditions. The medical community is just now scratching the surface as to how precision medicine can benefit our patients. Medical organizations aren't the only ones who see the potential in precision medicine. The White House recently budgeted $215 million for the President's Precision Medicine Initiative. This initiative will establish a 1 million participant cohort for extended research in precision medicine. The initiative will include genetic data, linked to electronic medical records, and capture lifestyle information. This data will be available to any qualified researcher with the intention to increase the rate of innovation in precision medicine. Millions of patients will benefit from the work of this initiative. Intermountain is excited about the President's initiative and eagerly looks forward to the advancements it will make in precision medicine. We at Intermountain Healthcare believe that our progress in this field is contributing to the future of precision medicine. Mm -hmm.